Okay. So I just hit start and stop. I should make sure I hit start again. Yep. Okay. So go ahead. So, 25, root 3, over 2, plus, well, the area of one of these equilateral triangles is 25 times the square root of 3, because the height is 5 root 3, and the base is 10. Okay. And there's two of them, so, 50 root 3. Okay. And then, we have to subtract minus 50 root 3. What's the 50 root 3? It's, you, we're, I'm subtracting the area of the rectangle from this. Okay. So. I might if I do some erasing here. Yeah. Okay. So, which means we're left with 25 root 3 over 2. And what's that? That's the area of the rhombus. Okay. Why did that work? That's a very clever solution, but why, why does it work? Well, because you're, because we just, it's, it's all valid. We just have to calculate this area. Okay, but what did you do? Like, what, can you explain in words what you did here to find the area of that? Well, the first thing I did was find the height of the equilateral triangle. Okay. Which was pretty easy. Yeah. Then, I, then I, I was planning on doing the diagonals. The, the 5 root 3 times the diagonal, Okay. but I came across another solution. So then when I found this, then once I found that, the, I found the area of this triangle, which was the area of this triangle. Okay. Then I added those two areas, plus the area of the equilateral triangle, and then we're over counting the rhombus twice. We've counted the rhombus twice. So you have the area of the square plus something. Yeah. And then that's what's left over. Okay, very good. Very good solution. See this line you drew in here? Yeah. You see anything? That line you drew in there makes a very interesting picture. There's a straight line. Yeah, it's a straight line. Can you see any other way to solve this problem? Hmm. Just look at one of the equilateral triangles. Well, we have this little top bit here on the triangle. Okay. But if if we found out what the area of that was, the top bit looks like it's a quarter of the area of the equilateral triangle. Okay, so what would the area of the rhombus be then? It would be a half of the area of the equilateral triangle. And what was the area of the equilateral triangle? It was... 25 root 3. So it's the area of the... So it is 25 root 3 over 2. Okay. See the four equilateral triangles? The, the equal, one of the equilateral triangles gets chopped up There's into... There's good one. Sorry. Into four equilateral triangles like that. See that? Yeah. There. This is an equilateral triangle. All those angles are 60. This is an equilateral triangle. That's an equilateral triangle. That's an equilateral triangle. All of them sides are 5 instead of 10, so yeah. these all are 1 fourth, and there's two of them. It's another way to go. I like your solution though, over counting and then figuring out what you over counted. Good job. Good job on that problem. Nice approach.